Hello everybody, English Woodsman here. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Most of all, thank you very much for clicking on my video. Now in this video, we're gonna be taking a look at a new hammock from One Wind. If you subscribe to my channel already, you'll know I've been using a lot of the One Wind equipment over the last four or five months on my channel. And One Wind listened to a few of the comments about their equipment and they've come out with probably their best hammock up to date. Now this hammock is a One Wind hammock built in with their mosquito net, bug net, or whatever you like to call it on it. Previously, they made the hammock and then they made a big net that went all the way under it. And when you climbed inside it, you had to lean underneath the hammock and actually pull the cord closed. If you're getting out through at night, you'd have to find that cord, open it back up and climb out. It wasn't such a major problem, but now, like I say, they've made it all in one hammock. Now, this is the 12 foot hammock. They do it in 11 foot as well. But on Amazon, you have to sort of have a look you know which is available at the time now straight away is gonna be one thing I'm gonna say what I wish one wind would do they bring out the the straps with every hammock you get you get a set of straps with it and these ones are blue now they have some what are orange yellow color can't they have them in green or even brown black and brown black and green whichever way it just helps it look a little bit more natural in woodland green or a brown color keep to black straps and just change the color inside now i took this little storage sack off of uh, one of my other hammocks as well just in case this one doesn't have one on i haven't seen it on it so you need this as well for part of the hammock now what i'm going to do is i'm going to get these set to the tree and i'll show you setting the hammock up and i'll show you the hammock itself That's all you need to do. Put one end through the loop and just pull it just like that. Barely no messing around really. What I like about the uh, stuff sacks as well is you can release the hammock from either side. So you don't have to worry about having to get it out and put it all over the floor. And then you'll come to these buckle ideas here. And all you have to do is get the end of the cord tree hug, tree strap, feed it under and back through like that and then that takes the weight of yourself in the hammock and it's very simple if you want to release it just push it down and then you can just slide it back down I'm not going to put it too tight yet because I want to get the other side up. Double zip, so it doesn't matter which side you sleep it, you can open it from either side. So you can see here, but it's got a built-in ridge line. Well, if you really want to get a bit more tension, what you do is get it, just pull it to your right, let be your left hand side on the camera, and it really lifts it up. And that'll lift the bug net right off your face when you're in the hammock. So earlier, when I run about this old red organizer, what I took off one of the other one wind hammocks, I think it would have been better for one wind to supply one of these with the hammock as well this is something you're gonna need as well and it's for this reason the bug net or mosquito net comes off all the way around from the hammock to this little end point here and it stops there so if you don't want your bug net on you just take it off stick it in the little organizer and you can just tuck it into the corner of your hammock just like that this hammock is one full piece of material. There's no sense of stitching, no stitching on each side. This is a full piece material. I do like that a lot. It's why if you're, I doubt you are, anybody could be, over 107 stone, you'd be all right in this hammock. It may be pushing to its limits, but 107 stone, 1,500 pounds, that's a lot, a lot of weight. 
I like that it's nylon. Now this is the 12 foot hammock. They do it in the 11 foot as well on Amazon. What I'll do is I'll share a link in the description to this video with the word EWM23. That's my discount code. If you use that code, you'll save some money and I get a little bit off of another item that I want to buy from them. There's a few other little bits here. What I'm definitely going to show you. This attaches to your under blanket. Now, one thing I am going to say is this hammock is £70, just short of £70 on Amazon. Let me know what you think about that. I'm going to get this uh, bug net back up and we'll have a look at it then. As you can see it's got these black clips and you can actually attach that to your under blanket you've got one your second one there and your third one just further on and you've got that on the opposite side as well so the six of them so you can very simply just attach them to your under blanket and it keeps your under blanket and your hammock all in one right let's see how it goes we're getting inside it Right, so I'm going to be honest with you guys now in video and I do not like to bid a piece of equipment up if it's not worth bidding up. This hammock, I think, is my 2022 camping hammock. Now I say that because I like the idea you can completely unzip the mosquito net or bug net, stick it in the overhead storage sack there and it's nicely out of your way. When I'm in the hammock, there seems to be a little bit too much material flapping over and the bug net didn't seem to be a bit too much bug net, should I say. I've set the hammock the same way I set any hammock up, so I do know it's set up to my way I like it. It seems to be a little bit of over material, but what I'm going to do over Christmas is I'm going to get my full one wind equipment out from the Four Seasons under blanket, the quilts, uh, Everything I've got to make a full winter setup, and what I'll do, I'll come back out, we'll attach it all together as you need, and I'm going to see if that just sorts out the slightly too much material on the hammock, okay? Now, so far, I think a little bit of more material is my sort of thing, so when I move around through the night in my sleeping bag, I'm not causing any tension in the material, so it, it could rip. The over material, I do think, may be a good thing. Now what I'll do is, like I say, over Christmas I'll come out, I'll do that video. I've got to get myself off, so I'm going to a group camp tonight. I'll share all the links in the description below for yourself, so you can know where to have a look at it if you want to have a look at it. Remember, EWM23 will give you a discount on the hammock itself. I'm not selling you it, I just want to show you it. And if you're new to my channel and you want to see the setup what I'm on about, you can press this here by subscribing to my channel. Check out a video up there where I did a camp with some of the woman equipment. And if you're already subscribed to me, thank you very much. And I'll definitely see you guys next time.